Arise Asia 二零二三在七月二十五号到二十九号，邀请来自三十五个国家一千八百位三十岁以下青年领袖，齐聚在泰国曼谷，举办第一届亚洲青年宣教大会，共同领受 One Life One Challenge， 仅此一生回应挑战的使命，勇敢迎向宣教。In our place, our place is a Hindu-dominated area, and、uh, the government is a pro-Hindu, which means the temples get to do a lot of things which they want. So what they normally do is they build a lot of speakers up on the temple and blast their worship music, their bhajan music, every morning and every evening. So what I did from that, from after they left, whenever I heard the music in the morning. I would get irritated, but I would raise my hands towards the temple and say, "Ah,、oh, Lord, you are good. God, you reign in this place. You are Lord of this place." I'll just keep on praising. Right. So there is power in worship. Right. So after one month or two months or 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 doing so, I don't remember exactly, but be, but between that, the leader of that place, who is a Hindu himself, he went and complained to the temple authorities about the noise. So suddenly, like it's like from the volume from volume ten, it came down to two. Now it's like very soft. Now, in this testimony, like there is power when we worship God.、Right? Normally, I would not been able to go and influence them because my friend went and talked with them. He got scolded and said, "Right, <laughs> they are not willing to listen." And since they are uneducated people, they are like, "Oh, we are we are Hindus. We must follow this one. They are very stringent on it." But when we worship, you know, God does our work. So since it's a Hindu do dominated area, we are slowly, slowly, we working on it. But I want my heart is to teach the small children and the youths. I want to focus on those because all people, yes, they are very important. They are very precious. Yes, but the young people are the future. So my job, a job of a missionary, is to go and preach the gospel. God's job is to change their life. My job is not to change people's life, but it is the gospel who change people's life. When I was in Taiwan serving,、uh, I remember on that day I was doing prayer walking, and that the Lord actually gave me a vision of this guy sitting on a stone, and he was also revealing like this guy is actually seeking for purpose and、um, what is life all about and and not what not. Yeah, so. Um, two weeks down the road, we actually met this guy, and this guy he was also he was in the park um in Tainan as well, and he was sitting on a on a stone, and like we were ap approaching him and asking him, oh why are you here alone alone? And he said, oh I'm actually seeking for what's life and what not. Yeah, so it's like oh wow, like you know like God actually revealed to us、uh, way before that, and that we are able to pray before to like you know um help him through um. Um, the season to see um what is God's purpose in life. I think as a fresh、uh, person in mission field, it's exciting. It's also scary. There's lots of uncertainty as well. Yeah, but I think it is just stepping out in faith. Yeah, and to do what God's calls you to do. I think like someone actually once told me that um. Um, there isn't always a fixed plan, but I think to be avail to avail yourself for God is something. It's a privilege to serve Him. Yes. When we were on the when we were on the Lagos trip,、uh, there's a time we went to a place called the Bahamas, a、uh, uh, Caribbean island, and because、uh, the hurricane attacked the island years ago and things get destroyed,、um, we went to、uh, the. The ship sent us to that island for、um, for four days to help、uh, a granny、uh, to rebuild her roof. We thought like ah、oh, the fourth the fourth day we are finished and and then we can we can go. Then when we wake up ah、uh, I remember one of the leader the leader just suddenly tell us like hey guys、uh, the ship has the ship has gone. I like what why? Oh because last night they have a storm so the the ship need to like escape like escape from the storm. So they they move away. So can you guys stay for ten more days in the island? I'm like yeah sure. <laughs> then then we 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 extend our like it's like an adventure. Like we just extend our time on that island and to surf. So we're not just like we're not just like enjoy our life and the beach and stuff like that. But then we we also、uh, receive another、um, call that there's a school. So because of the storm, have like、uh, soak the 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 roof. So it's totally damaged. Tough, tough job, and and that is that house is not just a normal house, but it's a school also. So,、uh, for yeah, a school for a primary school. So like, 
10 more days, we just like go like all of the energy. It's like so tired. Finally, like all of us, we take off the roof, job finished. And I thought like, oh, okay, now we're done. Let's go. But then our our team mem uh, our team leader say, hey, don't go. Don't go, uh, uh, sweep the floor. There's many uh, sand and stuff like that. But then suddenly the, the owner of the school come, he stand, he look at the place. You just wept, keep wepting. Oh, that time, I, it shocks me so much. It, he reminds me like, oh yeah, I'm not here just to do the construction. I'm not here just to like, uh, finish the job. But actually, someone is really hopeless. And God sent us to here to help them to stand up again. And at that moment, uh, the owners start questioning, many questions come to them. Why, why these people come here to serve us without taking any money? Why this young man from Hong Kong willing to go all the way from the other side of the world to come here? Why, why, why? And because of all this why, I'm able to share the gospel with him. It's not how good I am, it's not how beautiful I am, but it's because how I have experienced the love of Christ that I can't hold this love, I need to fly all the way to the other side of the world to come here to tell you God loves you. It's not how good I am, but it's just simply. So I think these are the journey that God brings me through. It's not, uh, it really helps me to understand our mission is not just helping people. Uh, like it's like, it's more, it reminds me also how He had bring me through all this time.